we now come to the point of our worship service to the table a time when we can celebrate the great love of God for each and every one of us. This, then, is one of the most precious times in our Christian lives. And though we are not together in physical person, we are together in the spirit of the Lord. And so it is in that spirit that we celebrate this meal together, one with each other and one with Christ. Today we do come together symbolically around this table, the young and the old, the rich and the poor, the least and the lowest, sinners and saints, together in communion. There are no strangers, no foreigners, only brothers and sisters in the sight of God. Each and every one is invited. As we gather together then today, we do so giving thanks we give thanks because Jesus showed us the way. We give thanks because Jesus is the way. Jesus was a gift from God for the entire world. He was called Emmanuel, God with us. He came to save us from our sins. Jesus lived a life of thankfulness and he gave his life as a sacrifice for many. We give thanks that he is our savior, Christ the Lord. And as we gather, we remember. We remember Jesus, both his presence as God with us, and we remember Jesus and his life and his love. We remember that on the night before he died, Jesus took the bread and he gave thanks, saying, this is my body, which will be broken for you. and he shared it with his disciples. We remember that after the meal was over, Jesus took the cup and he gave it to his disciples saying, this is my blood, which will be shed for you. When you drink of this cup, you will do it in memory of me. So as we gather at this table, we eat the bread and we drink the cup. And we remember Jesus' suffering and his death on the cross. We will remember the one who died to bring us life. And we will also remember and keep remembering and keep sharing this meal until he returns again. These then are the gifts of God for the people of God. Please take your bread. This is the body of Christ, broken for you and for me. Take of it and eat. This is the blood of Christ shed for you and I for the remission of our sins. Take and drink. Let us pray. <clears throat> we thank you, Lord, for giving us this bread and this sacred meal. For your presence and your life and for reminding us of your everlasting grace, which will be celebrated for all eternity. Amen. 